Hey guys, welcome back to Quad Fitness. Uh, today we're going to be doing a pop over tra transfer back to the uh, chair from the mat or your bed. Uh, it's a little different uh, from either one. This is a pretty level transfer. Kind of sit to sit, is what they want to call it, pop over. It has all kinds of names. Uh, but basically, the technique's the same as when you go from your chair over to the mat. You want to position yourself fairly close. I really don't like to get too close because you want to give yourself enough room for your butt to come through and you want to have it go in the right position here. My side guards are built in so I don't want to come back too far. You also have the wheels to contend with back here so I always like to transfer to the front of the chair. You know, just enough to kind of get your butt on there. Uh, you know, so you feel stable enough and then adjust your position from there. You try and transfer back into the back of the chair in one shot, you're going to end up hitting your wheel or hit the side guards. Even if you have a removable side guard, you're going to hit your wheel. You're going to end up scraping uh, your butt on there. And, you know, you could run into issues with some kind of shearing or something like that. So I try and avoid that and just go right in the front, in front of the chair. So in order to do that, I like to position myself a little bit of an angle from the chair. You know, you don't want to line up like this and try and go because it just makes it even further, you know. Once again, kind of get yourself in a comfortable position, just like we talked about on the uh, shifting on the mat. I want my hand in the power position here. You can push down using all the muscles in your arm, tricep, your lats, get a little bit of chest in there, which is great, you know, if you don't have the strength in your tricep. So from this position here, once again, the lead hands out away from you, allowing enough room for your body to come through. You don't want your hand too close. You try and transfer into your hand. You're going to land on it. You're going to knock it out of the way. It's going to impede the ability for you to get where you want it to go. So you want to give yourself enough room for your body to come through into the transfer. Now when you're going back to the chair, same thing. Tossing that head, make sure you get the clearance, get that lift. It's going to make for an easier transfer. The more you're dragging, you're going to hit your chair, you're going to push it out of the way. Hands are going to get twisted, you're going to run into all kinds of issues. So you really want to get that that height. Another thing on where you're going back, don't be afraid to come forward. That's what you got your feet out here for. But make sure those are out far enough so when you're coming forward, your body weight's going out over your feet. You have your feet back underneath you, trying to do this maneuver. If you have to lean out over your body, and your feet are too close, you're going to face plant right over top of your feet. So, even though your feet aren't, you don't think they're doing much, they really are. So, it's kind of your pivot point. So, here we go. Try and go a little bit slower than I usually do, but Sometimes it's hard to slow a transfer down. I'm trying to go half speed. So from this position, pause for effect. Mm -hmm. Transfer. That's it. I try to pause halfway, halfway through to kind of see what was going on. And see where my head was going. I'm going to go back and do a full speed now. I wanted you guys to really see what was happening in the middle of the transfer. It's hard to really slow it down, but... Same thing. Comfortable position. Hand on the chair. I like to kind of have it on the edge here because I kind of almost pull it into me. That way I know it's not going to push away from me as you're going. That's kind of my little my little thing. You do whatever you feel comfortable with. I like to kind of hold it in towards whatever I'm, I'm sitting on. Make sure that chair's not going anywhere at the same time as I'm transferring. It almost helps pulling you too. Gives you a little bit of, a little bit more pull towards it. So. Okay, so I'm going to go full speed.
push back into the back of your chair, do your brakes, your business.